Walker, star of the Fast and Furious films, was a passenger in a friend's car when that red Porsche lost control, hit a light pole and tree, and burst into flames. Pictures from the scene show the extent of the impact and the damage. Walker going to a charity event in between filming his latest movie. He personified young Hollywood with matinee looks and an action-packed resume. Paul Walker raced into the spotlight in 2001 as star of The Fast and the Furious. But it was a long road to stardom. Born and raised in California, Walker had been in front of the camera nearly his entire life, appearing in commercials as a toddler, TV as an adolescent, and supporting movie roles as a young adult. But it would be as LAPD undercover cop Brian O'Connor that Walker finally got his breakthrough. The Fast and the Furious paired him with actor Vin Diesel in a story about street racers and crime sprees. It also launched a film franchise still churning out blockbusters more than a decade later. Off the set, Walker was a car enthusiast and competed in a road racing series for several years. Walker would keep working in films but always come back to the role that made him famous. He was currently filming the seventh installment and tweeted this picture with his co-stars just a week ago. Saturday night, his team posted on his Facebook page confirming the actor's death in a car crash, writing, It is with a truly heavy heart that we must confirm that Paul Walker passed away today in a tragic car accident while attending a charity event for his organization, Reach Out Worldwide. He was a passenger in a friend's car in which both lost their lives. Walker was 40 years old and is survived by his 13-year-old daughter. One person is dead and another is facing serious charges tonight after two...